Hello and good day. Welcome to the YouTube channel Unisupport, learning made easy. Today we are going to talk about an online resource to conduct the student assessment via online system that is available at www.classmarker.com. Well, due to the recent scenario and the shift in the major education industry from uh, in-campus to online studies, uh, most of the teachers are thinking of using some resource which is reliable enough to conduct the student assessment in a, a manageable manner. So I found this uh, tool uh, quite helpful where I am conducting uh, my class assessments and quizzes through this system. So in this video I'm going to quickly talk about the general features, its benefits of the system, its strengths against other available systems and uh, the uh, other features which are uh, provided in this classmarker.com so without any further ado so without any delay let's start so here is the interface of the class marker tool so the, as I said that it is available at www.classmarker.com so this has two types of the registrations or paid member and unpaid members and I will talk about the uh, unpaid or the free registration uh, mainly where uh, most of the features which are required for the basic testing of the students is available for free right so let's start with its general features first why we should you go for this is an easy to use online testing system it has a controlled user login environment and has no software requirements to be installed. So there you see that uh, the test taker is given a link to a test and he can attempt that test using his own credentials. So in this way your test is quite safe. It cannot be attempted by anyone who is not authorized to. And then you, you can check the marks and, and exams and, and the IP addresses of the students that who is attempting from the unique sites rather sitting all of them together. So in this way, class marker is quite secure, trusted. And another feature in this tool is that the class marker provides the excellent functionality of question bank. So the question bank is the online resource which is offered by class marker where you can enter different questions at once. You can make them as a principle or the fixed questions or they could be the random questions uh, depending upon the type of the subject and uh, and the important and the significance of those questions a wide variety of the question types are given by the class marker you can set up some multiple choice questions you can set up true false questions matching the columns ones you can also give the short answers or fill in the blanks or the long answers uh, like essay type questions and many other types we can easily update images for labeling the diagram or we can give, an, give the attached files to read through like case studies or, or some other articles on which the student later has to reflect in their answers. And one uh, very significant feature in the question bank is that once you are setting up your questions for the later use in the test, you can assign them to the various categories and that makes it quite easy to set up a well-balanced question paper for your students. Um, to explain it, I would say that if you have to set up some questions which are very hard in their expertise level or you want to set up a question which is uh, a, a, a complex type of the questions, then you have to set up maybe 50% questions to the normal 50% uh, or average class students and then you have to set up 10% questions to, which are quite easy to enable the students to score the good marks. So later when you're going to set up your quiz, you can uh, you can set the automatic procedure to pick up five questions from the hard category, for 10 questions from the average category and five questions from the easy category, right? So this is a quite easy way to set up uh, a well-balanced question paper. Then once you have prepared this test, then class marker gives you a uh, freedom to use two channels by which you can deliver or distribute your question paper to your students remotely. The one is via link and, and the other one is via group. The one is via groups and the other via links. Group means you have to set up a group of your class students where you authorize your class students to register themselves using a unique code 
generated by class markers upon your request and you give it to the students and they register using those codes and automatically they get into your groups so how to make those groups I will uh, give a link to those videos Th then via links you can send the test to the to the students using a link where they can attempt anyone with the link can attempt that quiz where there is no class and no authorization uh, required but the thing is that for this uh, free version of that class marker test given given by the uh, by the links will not be saved in your profile and you won't be able to review their answers or review the marks later however if you create a group of the students and the students attempt the test using the group uh, function your test would be saved in your profile and you can review the unmarked questions you can see their results and you can save those results and show it to your students so i would prefer to use a group function right test setting is a quite versatile in class marker where you can save a test you, you can reuse the same test to the other classes or to other events and you can give students an option to start a test and if in case uh, disconnectivity happens or some uh, their computer breaks down or, uh, or they cannot attempt the question at some time or due to some uh, disturbance they can save their test and start it again and tests are given normally with a timer on the test and so that the timer stops with with the time they save the test and once they resume the timer resumes from the same spot so this is a quite handy feature but this feature is not available in any other uh, competitive softwares which are which are giving this uh, for free and then you can we can schedule the test for the students where they they are told earlier that at some particular date at a particular time the test would be vi visible to them and they can attempt that and if you want you can customize and brand your test providing your own logos and own directions and instructions on top of the test and those tests are printable as well once you have prepared an online test you can also print it for the physical exams as well but all of these features which I have mentioned are free to use and there are few limitations uh, in the free account that you can only conduct 100 tests or 100 uh, assessments in a calendar month and you can only save the results and review them back if you have taken the if you have given those tests via groups but uh, the free version don't allow you to create certificates email test results or batch import questions from uh, the pdf files or excel files and upload images or files so i hope you will give it a try and and if you like this video please subscribe to the channel and and hit the bell icon so that you can get updated about the new upcoming videos where I'm going to describe how to uh, add questions in the question bank in different under different categories uh, under the fixed category or random category and then I will also give the videos uh, video tutorials about how to set up a test and and check a test